Good morning. We won't be seeing any major cold snap today. Both lows and highs will be 2 to 3 degrees higher than yesterday, even hovering a couple notches higher than seasonal averages. And either rain or snow will fall across much of the country. And Seoul could see up to 5 centimeters of heavy snow fall in the evening. So it's the best if you leave your car at home for your evening commute. And as for the daily highs, Seoul will get up to 4 degrees Celsius, while Daegu will peak at 5 degrees, while other major cities could also see snow fall later in the day. And after snow and rain today, more wintry weather could be brewing for midweek, and we could see the coldest temperatures of the season starting Wednesday, and temperatures will plunge each day. With that, let's take a look at the international weather for viewers around the world. Well, most regions in South Korea will see either snow or rain in the evening hours. Most cities in North Korea will also see snow fall along with lower single-digit morning lows and afternoon highs. And as for the rest of Asia, Beijing will see strong gusts as the morning goes on and will have a bone chilling temperatures this week. Meanwhile, much of Sydney reached its peak temperatures on Sunday, with the city's west bearing the brunt of the heat, and things will get eased a bit on Monday. And heading to North America, the bitter cold that followed a massive snowstorm should begin to lessen in the east coast of the United States. Meanwhile, weather-related flight delays and cancellations kept many JFK passengers on the ground on Sunday. And as for South America, Sao Paulo will have much cooler readings along with showers. And taking you to Europe, those in Rome will enjoy unseasonably mild temperatures under mostly sunny skies. Lastly, to Africa, major cities on the map will enjoy mostly sunny skies except Algiers. And that's all the weather update for now.